do it. Do it. Uh uh, I ain't falling for that. Uh uh. <laughs> He's gonna pee. He's <laughs> gonna see what it's talking about just tell my brother-in-law that like i kind of want to do like my own little like juicing i don't know side hustle i juice every morning i make smoothies every morning for my son i'm if you have me on instagram like um i'm always making acai bowls i don't know i just think it's so dope but my focus is right now it's just real estate and um youtube so i don't know it just i don't really help i don't want my focus everywhere but at the same time i don't know it's just something i really really like to it just really depends on timing. And this is my juice. It's called Green Lemonade. It is, what comes on? I can't read. This is Sunrise Acai Bowls. It looks just like what I make at home, pretty much. I really like the granola that you put me on. The Kroger, I mean, not the Kroger, the Target granola. Gr granola, granola, yeah, super fire. And it looks, it actually, it looks really good. It is very good. Cause I love smoothies, like, this is the extra, so she put it in there. She said they normally have extra. So she didn't charge us for this little baby smoothie, yeah. which that's what's up. We'll have Zayed do the honors. This homeboy be going in. Go ahead, Zayed. What you think, oh, boy? I don't like it. Yeah, he's not like it. Love smoothies. Every morning he takes my smoothie all the time. Yeah. It's making me so mad. Mmm. It is. You want to try it with ice? Oh, you. Mm. I just lift the little bit up. You like it? Better yeah. than yours? Um, it's just very lemony. Like that. Yeah. Um, I, I, I put a lot of fruit in my. So mine's super sweet, but this one you can definitely tell is healthy. <laughs> My first bite was okay. Who put you on this place? I just looked it up. No, oh, because you wanted to, like a. I love the acai bowls in Indy. And this is, the, this is the one that came up. And the one in Carmel that we tried. That they have one cool. downtown too. When, when my husband and I, when we get to like where we want to be in life, my goal is to have like our own little like juicery, smoothie, like something like this that way we can go every morning stop by before we like have to do stuff you know i don't know go look at houses or some shit and just have our breakfast ready for us save me time from having to make it really good the only thing what? is that like it melts super fast mm -hmm. mm. So that's why there's ice in this right mm -hmm. so there's ice in it when i make mine I, I never put ice in it. I, I just freeze my fruit. Because I like my smoothie bowl super thick. But you know what I like to put? I like to put peanut butter in my, in my That's smoothie That's what I wish it had. Peanut butter, yeah. Mm -hmm. Before I never liked like peanut butter with fruit, but whenever I started putting it in, um, because Smoothie King puts it in theirs, and the one that I get, the Daily Warrior. Makes you feel good after you eat this. Uh huh. Makes you feel good. That's why I said like it's it's not a heavy breakfast. It's a like a wake me up, energize, you feel good, feel healthy for part of the day. And, and in the mornings, I kind of like to I like to eat lighter in the morning. And then like towards the end of the day, I just eat whatever I want. Mm. With the big chunks of ice. Yeah, that's the only thing. Cause it's kind of watery, you know. You can kind of see, but like my, yeah, passionate. yeah. I don't know. I'm not gonna lie. I make I make some pretty good smoothie bowls. Oh yeah. 
is my favorite one I could buy. That's what I should say. Yeah. I give you a good, a good eight. Because the area is nice. The area is nice. The vibe's nice. The birds chirping. Like, and it's almost like, because the houses in this area are super, super nice. So it's kind of like inspiring almost in a way. Like, this is how you, like, when you're at in life where you want to be, this is how you want to start your day. You know? Walk this is, down the street. Walk, walk to the freaking juicing company. Yeah. There's no. I give it a good eight. Only, I wouldn't give them a 10 just because the ice in the bowl. And, I don't know. I, I, I really like fruit, so I just stay put too much fruit but i understand like they're trying to be healthy and the way i make my smoothie bowls not that it's not healthy i just put well my smoothie bowls are healthy my my juices i put a lot of fruit in it but i mean you can always fix that it's easier to make it at home but i don't know something about like spending your money on it makes it taste better no <laughs> yeah. right Whatever he makes it go, he's like, that's not fair. <laughs> Beto was like, it's kind of like life. <laughs> hit, it, hit, it, hit, it. hit it, hit it, get it, get it. Make it, Ray. Boy, into the goal. <laughs> okay, JB. JB. <laughs> Jay How does the baby's thing go, babe? In the song? That's not the baby. No, that's not the baby. That's my baby. <laughs> my baby. <laughs> my Your baby. baby. That's my baby. Yeah. Baby, baby thinks you're talking about Saeed. Yeah. <laughs> he said, that's my baby. Chopping up grams and them choppers on top in their hands. Taking it like they got an exam. Y'all already know the vibes. Sun King is our spot. We normally go to the downtown location, but today we're here at the Broad Ripple location. Broad Ripple is basically the area where like all the young folks, college kids hang out. It's a really cool area. It's an, and it's a lot of like local um, places in this area. Have you been to this location before? Yeah. You have? I'm telling you, we came, we came here when we were walking on the... Oh, I know, babe, but we didn't come inside. I know, but we didn't yeah. here. here. You have? Oh, are you recording? Yeah. No, I didn't know. You should tell me here. <laughs> I have, babe, the camera is right here. It's I, right I, here the whole time. I'm seeing something else. Oh. I kind of like it, but I honestly don't think it's better than the um, downtown location, to be honest. I'm gonna get used to it. I, I mean, looks. Like I'm, used, I'm more used to the downtown one. Yeah, yeah, that's how I feel. Go there for a bit. It's not bad. Yeah. One day, there's more. Sorry, but um, I was gonna say there's more uh, like light here, sunlight. Yeah, yeah. The other one's more garage looking. You guys, I did not know that they like. I thought that they just sold like just beer, but they have free, they have wine here. They have their own tequila here, and they make like different mixed drinks. That's kind of dope. I didn't know that. Today I wanted to try something different because I like the pachanga a lot, but I haven't tried outside of that. Like since I liked it so much, I just stuck with it. But now I kind of want to try something new. But they have um like they have a bloody mary here, like a michelada, like a like a mixed coffee drink, I guess, with coffee liqueur. I don't know. That look, I want to try one to see how they are. We'll see though. I forget what he called this drink. Something. I, I don't remember what he called it, but we're going to try it. Um, it is it is super light. He said that it was very light. It, yeah, it's, it's almost too light. I don't know how I feel about that. And then this is like an orange one. Some, what kind is it? Cream. Huh? Like cream, no? Orange cream. Right, right, right. Orange cream. That, it sounds good. Orange oh, cream? Yeah. It sounds nasty to you? It sounds good to me. Mm, and it is good. 
I like that one. But it kind of tastes like soap, not gonna lie. It kind of tastes like soap. But it was, it was good. Yeah. But what I. ¿Qué pasó? What I ended up ordering was, I mean, I want to finish off drinking beer. I want to stay drinking beer, but um, I also want to try something different. So I got, what did I get? Where is it at? It's called Mink Condition. It's a, it's their agave. And then agave simple syrup, pomegranate and pineapple juice, and lime juice. Sounds good. My drink is finally here and it looks so good. It's a super cute drink. We're gonna taste it ahorita. This isn't water. This isn't water. He keeps reaching for my drink. <laughs> Look, he pushes it away. <laughs> he doesn't want it. Okay, we're gonna taste this. It looks so good though. Papi, be nice. Hey, no hagas eso. Don't do that, okay? And it is really good. Okay? It's hey. super good. Be nice. I really taste the pineapple juice and the pomegranate juice. Fire. Look at that old school car over there. Right in front of us. You're gonna have to wait. Hold on. Oh, did you see Yeah. Look what we have here banana split with peanuts, cream. So, so fire. And it's actually custard, it's not ice cream. It's from here at. Let's go eat some rice. This is Bethel's first time here. Look at him. Boated and goaded. Look at you. You never been to a hibachi grill. A hibachi grill. This is a hibachi grill. Oh. But there's another one in Portland, you know? Yeah. That's my favorite. Takioka. That's my favorite. There's another one, I think. Oh, Kodo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. Alright, let's go. I don't like mushrooms, so I never eat them. But I want to, you taste it. You're ready? Huh? You're ready? Yeah. It's a big old mushroom, it's, it's, Yeah, don't eat the mushroom. You don't like mushrooms, right? I should remove the mushroom. It's good, right? Yeah, but some, huh? Soup, yeah, but sometimes they put like the little, like the the onion crisps on top. Ooh, yeah, fine. it is very fine. Some kind of cheese, right? Hella cheese. Oh, oh that's, that's French. That, that's French onion soup. Okay. Yeah. yeah, that's really fire too. That's hella fire. That's it's really good. good. You'd like it. He's gonna try. He's gonna try the mushroom. No, I never. Did. Yeah, <laughs> try it. Do I'm it, scared. do it. Ah. I knew you wasn't about that life anyway. Do it. I'll do it if you do it. I'm not trying to push. I don't like it. I don't like mushrooms either. Like something about it being a natural fungus, like that's just nasty. Yeah. And putting that in my body just don't sound right. The salad. It's, a, it's their ginger salad, so. but when it comes to like hibachi grill, there's a place in Fort Wayne called Takioka. The vibe's different because all to, all hibachi grills like Kodo, Safaro, they all look the same. But the um, Takioka is a local place, and well, I don't know if they're just local to Fort Wayne, but um, the whole vibe's just different. I really like it. Like the ambiance is still dark, but um, it's, it's fire. Egg rolls are so important like I mean I, I just don't think anyone can compare to Saigon's egg rolls but there's some really fire egg rolls too it looks good not gonna lie though is it really good it's really good Saigon, but like how close, like how close would you say good? It's just different. Yeah. It's his own thing. It's because it's a, they use the actual egg roll wrappers. Yeah. Here we go. We normally like the egg rolls that have like the spring roll wrappers, but the one they're fried. I don't know. They just want crispy. This looks. This one looks really good though. Oh, it's good. It's just in Saigon. You know what? 
you see, she's my mom. My mom is gonna give her like this. Really? Yep. Just like this. Then she took me back. Then she took me back. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. My mom had like my mom just had this obsession with like Asian culture. I think she always carried a Buddha in her purse. She had like you ever see the, the little Chinese cat? Like, like, yeah. like, um, like they make like a sound, no? Like the little cat. Well, hers did. It, it was a piggy bank. It was a gold piggy bank. Like the, you know what I'm talking about, right? They have like Chinese buffets and shit. That. And she would just make like all kinds of like this crab rack and all kinds of shit. <laughs> Girls at, um, uh, at Twin Peaks. Wouldn't you agree? There's not, there's not a lot of ugly girls at Twin Peaks. Wouldn't you agree? Yeah. Don't ask me that. <laughs> Shut uh -uh. up. Uh-uh. I ain't falling for that. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do me like that. Not on camera. I gotta record this because you ain't never ever parked this close to a building before. You normally be making me walk for a mile. Babe, you've been making me walk so far. Well, you know, today I'm feeling nice and it's a great day, so I'm gonna park us here. Actually, had, I called in and had this. Ah, shut up! I had it reserved for us. You looking like you got VIP access. All right. Oh shit, I forgot my mask. We're gonna go play, Ray! No, no, right there. It is so deep, huh? Right there. That's what I said. So they give you these little socks to put on and you just like literally run wild. It's it's so fun though. Look at these little baby socks, they're so cute. They're ready to go in. But Beto had to use a rush was so bad. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
I get to the point. You think you got the bomb? Cause I wrote you a joint. You so